how this goes. Let me get out a bit deeper. Over here. Big down breeze today. Huge down breeze. And there's a guy mowing right behind me. Hopefully the driver works. Been a bit iffy. Healing big draws, but. That's deep. A bit right. Real deep. Might be might be around the corner. We'll see. Actually just snuck on in the middle of the comp. Old old Gaz. Told me there's a gap coming up. There was. All the greenies are sneaking in as well. But we'll see how we go. Hopefully my mic's working. I think it is. But yeah, we'll suss it. I've actually got pretty far down here. Um, if I can switch pretty close to the green on the 10th. Banks down. A bit right though, but I mean, pretty much pretty much playing off the off the ladies today. That T was that far ahead anyway. You're going to hit I don't know, I might hit a little six iron, just try and a bit sticky at the front there and a bit of Bit of grass to carry, but we'll see how we go. No glove for these ones. I don't use a glove inside 100 meters. So we're stuck on the ground for now, but. All right. Through the gap. I mean, I don't know. If I can even just sneak it on, I'll be doing all right, I reckon. It's a bit, uh, a bit iffy. Oh, stick straight on the left side of that dead tree. Been punching it really bad lately, so we'll see how we go. All I have to do is hit it straight. And not that way. So, first one, pretty much shanked it, so we'll try and just go straight through here. Green keeper's on his phone, doesn't know I'm here, because no one hits it here. Gonna let me go. No embarrassing. Stretch. Uh, that was almost as worse as the first one. Eleventh. It's a long five foot if I've ever seen one, but you know, what do you do? Broke my mic. First hole, first time I've ever used it. Phone fell off the stand and landed straight on the mic and broke it. Pitched here. Pretty big eight ohm for me, 150. But didn't make up for that bogey on the if I read into it more I would Oh. We're taking out the pro pin as well. Some guys on there for like seven meters. But take it, we needed a birdie. I want to just flared one way right. Stupid. Probably should use hit driver, honestly. Freewood's gonna get me. Same shit anyway. 
Eight, eight. It's like a par five anyway. Par five. Gotta make six now, but. Be alright. Par five, I'm alright now. We got like under 100. But I gotta get up and down for par. Ideally, just wanna hit it on the green from here and not make any other bogeys, stupid bogey as it is already. We're like 30 meters water carry, but it's only like 10 short of the green. Hard sandwich, there's a bit of a backstop behind you. I don't really think I'll hit sandwich too long, but try to keep it a bit low. I like to hit wedges lower, not trying to pop it up in the air. Didn't spin as much as I'd like, but it was right on it. So Coming up to the green. I don't know why that didn't spin that much. Like it all slopes towards the front. But just how golf works, I guess, you know? Backstop doesn't spin. That's just just how it is, unfortunately. good just harsh lip out Jesus but gotta be able to wait for the next tee so do some putting the 13th Bankstown R3 you know he usually plays like 155 fish it's a bit a bit into us today Pretty into it, so I'm gonna hit seven. Just a just a seven. Not a bad number, honestly. Hit seven, pin high. We'll take it. Made the par. The fringe was kind of like... Because it, it's like a... I don't know what kind of grass it is, but... It kind of like... Sticks up quite a lot off the fringe. So I just... I had to like... I took it back and I had to like lift it up and then just like... But I just thaw him it down on the back of it. But... I <clears throat> probably should have just stopped, but... Some two ball from behind has come out of nowhere. On my case. So... Keep going. The uh, R5 14th, the banks down at the back tees. As you can see, we're pretty far up today. But is what it is. Got the new paths in, looking good. Par five. Just try and hit the dog. Um, trying to drive it. I think I'm gonna like aim down the left a bit. I feel like I'm gonna hit draws, but they fade. And that's what happens when I aim left. Hit big snap hooks. <laughs> it's been killing me lately, eh? I, all my mates will know. Ah. Uh, anyway, only one over. But. Snap hooks don't help. Luckily I'm playing off the ladies tees today. Not really, but the whites are up, so. Sit a good three wood and have like nine iron or wedge in. 
Hopefully I can get it out. We'll see how we go. Pretty dead here. Pretty good shot for pretty good punch for once. I had some ladies behind me, so I didn't want to talk too loud, but I think that would look pretty cool on the camera. Probably got like mm, maybe seven or eight in. See how it goes. 124. What I say? 99. Uh, I think it kind of switched now. It's probably off the left. I like helping a little. Pretty good nine for me, honestly. I don't want to go long though. What I say? 124 nine is pretty big for me. I just flew that like 135 absolutely dead against the tree it sucks though because i hit that quite well well i hit that good my foot slipped a little but i gotta get this to it but yeah i don't know if that wind was helping that much but definitely hit it hit it long i think it's really really dead <laughs> against the tree i didn't even see it bounce like it just disappeared so we'll see we'll see all right so i don't even know i feel like it flew like that might be my pitch mark there or something anyway classic cody can't hit that at all so i've got to take a no nah, that's risky i was gonna hit it hit it against a tree and then but it just dirt there, so. I mean, uh, pretty, pretty, pretty dead here. Big rule at Banks down is don't be hit it behind the 14th green. And now I'm on the bar. Um, I, I'm gonna try to hit a little seven. I've got to carry it right up the hill, but it might go super long. I mean, it's just on the fringe, but I've, you, if you've played Bankstown before, you have actually nothing from there, so we'll take it. Be a good par, if I can make it. Bad bogey, bad drive, but I got myself in a real good position. And Still made bogey. What I've been doing lately though, just dumb stuff like that. But it hurts. Par three. You better look that way. Par three fifteenth. Ah. Pretty short tees today. We're playing like 130 ish normally. Playing like 135, so like ideally, right? I should just hit 9 on. Actually, hit a decent shot. A six, seven foot behind it. So decent. Off the back slope. <laughs> Need a birdie. Good nine iron. Well, I carried that like 140 that time. You know? That was looking really good. That was looking really good. I like mark, I like just pick the ball up, I didn't even mark it, so to check back and see if that was uh, actually where the ball landed, but anyway, it gets a harsh lip out again. I haven't used this putter in like a year, so 
dude. You know, not hate it. I've come off the blade, so it should be. I don't know. Feels alright. Feels nice. That putt came. I putted that right where I wanted it. Bit of a harsh lip. All the edges were all rounded off. And I'll cut the comp today. The par four seventeenth. Oh, 16th, sorry. 16th at Bankstown. And like little slight dog leg left. It's a bit tight for a fader, but you know, I don't know if I fade or draw it. So, you know, I should be sweet, right? Hope for the best, hit one up the middle. Like, you know, I think it'd be nice to like, um, I don't think I've hit out of a fairway today. I got 95, no glove, need a birdie. I hit a little 50 degree. I feel like my sand wedge is not that, gonna go that far and I'll get stuck up on the hill. Just left of it, so see how we go. Not bad. Here's a slight tug pitched here. A little bit of suckies. There's slight right to left, kind of sloping all here, but looks like pretty flat. But I feel like if you don't hit it hard enough, it just breaks. Talk myself into a birdie. It's we needed. Now only one over. Going up 17. I'm only playing nine holes today. Too busy, eh? I was gonna play 18, but it's a bit too much. Par four, 17th, Banky. Um, kind of like you could hit it like 210, and you got like nine iron wedge in, sometimes less. So I might see driving iron here. Right, oh, there's a the I thought there was a guy still in the fairway, so it's like a three iron, I guess. The fairway. Um, like 114 in, it's pretty into me though. I'm gonna hit pitch and wedge. Probably, it's probably a good wedge. Um, left side of the green. Haven't been checked out yet. Check out Walker Golf. New Partech stuff, so good. Got a lot of golf shorts, and these are these are the best ones I've ever had. Big shout out to Walker Golf, sending me a couple boxes. All right, need another birdie here to finish even par through the nine. Still got 18 to go. Knifed it. A bit long now because I knifed it. <sighs> a bit deep there. A bit too much for a knifey wedge. Barely got like 20. 15, 20 meters off the ground. Uh. Damn it, that putty's like, it was down breeze downhill, right as I started to like line up, it started blowing pretty hard down my back. Got a bit scared, left it short. Par 418 at Bankstown. Pretty much just straight away. Bunkers at the right, like 230 and 250-ish or something like that, I don't know. But pretty, pretty straightforward hole. 
about 100, and, 100 meter water carry, a bit less. After that terrible drive, we're back on the 14th. I pretty much, I can't go up the green, I just gotta go hit a bunker shot, like 100, see how these people weigh, and then I'll have 80 in to the green. some trees but like not a lot of trees so I don't know if it got through maybe just in the rough I don't know I didn't see it drop though so that's kind of concerning me but yeah, this is what I was facing up and over I kind of just nicked this first one but it didn't really it just hit leaves oh I think I see it there might be okay a little punch out on the path So, I hope that is just my phone screen protector, but I just punched out good, hit this piece of wood and stopped. So, got to get up and down for a fiver. and five in the end it's pretty much my life lately actually that's okay for me two over pretty scrappy though kind of all over the place can't hit fairways here no good I'll try and do some more vlogs but back to work now so might see you next christmas but hopefully we get get the mic sorted and we can do more of these while it's still got daylight savings